Hello and welcome to AVA 3002, Integrated Safety Management Systems. My name is Matt and I'll be your tutor and your convener for this semester. So any questions you have about the unit, you can bring them straight to me. Um, we're going to discuss safety and what is it in the aviation industry and why is it so important. Um, we'll look at how the, uh, the safety performance of the aviation industry is doing at the moment and also how do we go about controlling safety so that we can uh, convince the regulator that our operation is safe and will be safe in the future and that is incredibly important. So I'm really looking forward to this semester. It's a really interesting subject and I hope you are too. I look forward to seeing you soon. But first of all, there are a few things that we need to do at the beginning of the unit so you're ready for the semester. So you'll have probably noticed we're in a different learning management system than we normally are. This uh, learning management system is called Canvas and I really like it. It's really streamlined and it looks really good on a mobile device and I'm hoping you'll find it easy to use too. It should allow us to do some really interesting things. Um, but first of all, I need you to get used to it. So have some time and just explore the environment and how it works. It's pretty easy. You can get anywhere by using the menu on the left down here. Go to modules and that'll take you into the course. And from there you work progressively through the pages of the course. At the moment, you'll just see the first two modules. I'll add a module every week. Before we meet in the first lecture, I'd like you to have a look through the syllabus and read that really thoroughly because that contains all the information you need to know about what's going to be happening over the next 12 weeks. And I'll give you a heads up, it's slightly different to a normal aviation unit. We've got a slightly different structure. I'm hoping actually you'll really enjoy this structure, so I'll just walk you through it now. The same thing is going to happen every week, the same set of activities. So at the beginning of the week, I will provide a video, an introductory video here on Canvas, where I'll tell you what to expect and what we're going to be learning about that week. Following that, at the beginning of the week, there'll be a two hour lecture at Hawthorne where you can come and watch me talk. Um, and following the lecture, there'll be an online quiz. And that online quiz is worth a small percentage um, of your assessment mark. And it's intended to make you reflect on the week's um, materials to see if you understand it or not. Later in the week, we'll have a one hour workshop. And this is quite different. So the workshop is not so much a lecture. It's designed to you, for you to get hands on with the, with the problem. So I will give you some questions and set you an in-class challenge and uh, in small groups or on your own, you'll just work with the materials and hopefully that'll allow you to understand the context of what we've been learning um, and, and just be better prepared and understand the subject matter better. Um, from there, we will have a one hour webinar session and this is probably very new. So every week I will schedule one hour of time where you can come online using the uh, Blackboard Ultra system, which I'll show you how to use in class, um, and chat with me. And I will make those chat sessions structured and it's an opportunity for you to ask any questions about the course and how it is going, any questions about the assessment and how it's going, but it also I'll set, you'll see this in the focus questions area of Canvas, I'll set a couple of um, discussion points that might be focused around a news article that's particularly relevant that week or just a couple of questions that I think you should, you should discuss to understand the subject. So please come to those two. So you don't need to be on campus for those web sessions, obviously you can access them from wherever you are. And in the first week we'll have a uh, chat and we'll figure out when the best time of the week is to set those webinar sessions. At the end of every week, there will be a survey on Canvas which opens up, which allows you to just tell me, it's called the muddiest point. So that is anything that you're struggling with or finding a little bit difficult to understand and you'd like some clarification, just type me a quick note in there and every week I'll look through the collective notes. It's completely anonymous and I'll just use that maybe to guide what we talk about in the webinar session and also to guide what I say in the following week's introductory video, just so we can all keep up to speed. And that is pretty much it. Everything I've just said is written down in the introductory module, so make sure you go and have a look at those. Um, oh, one last thing. If you need to contact me, it's a slightly different way of doing it this semester. So if you look in the menu down at the bottom, there's a help button. Click on that help button and at the top there will be a um, contact my instructor option. Now if you click on that, it'll open up a text box and essentially give you a field to enter in a question and that will, that will email me, but it will stay inside the Canvas system. 
Now, the reason I want to do that as much as possible this semester is that that means your emails or your questions get filtered out from my administrative emails and research emails, meaning you're more likely to get speedy response. Your, your inquiry won't get buried amongst a lot of other emails. So hopefully that'll allow us to stay um, in touch with each other more effectively. So if you can do that as much as possible, and if you've got any problems with it, you can always just use my email address, which is available through this Windows website. Great. Well, I look forward to seeing you in the first lecture of the semester. Um, come prepared with lots of questions and lots of enthusiasm. And until then, take care.